All right, back. We're kind of getting to the end of Act 1 now. Um, I gotta change out these things. Uh, I think I gotta collect these hoops later. But over here... Now this... Just had me... When I first played this game... Way back when... I'm, I'm old, I admit it, I'm old. Um, the real me is older than April. April would have been a very young girl when this game came out. Or maybe she, the game is older than her. I really have not figured that part of her history out yet. Um, I only accidentally discovered this. Keep loving them bees there, sir. Sorry, I didn't quite catch that. <clears throat> uh, uh, I said, do please keep away from the bees. They're very dangerous. You need the right equipment, see? A veil, smoke, that kind of thing. Oh, come on. They're not that dangerous, oh. are they? Oh, yeah, oh, I do have smoke. yes. Yes, indeed. Last fellow here who tried to mess with that hive ended up stung, bewitched, and turned into the helpless love slave of the Bee Queen. Really? As the gods judge me, sir, he was off there collecting pollen day and night just for the privilege of seeing her mandibles crease up in a smile, sir. Awful. Awful the degradation he got put through, sir. Oh, God, it must have been horrible. Yes, yeah, sir. The, uh, the pollen made me sneeze something awful. I think, at this point, I should, uh, um, buzz off. Oh, yes. And people thought Bee Movie was bad. Look, can I have some wax out of the beehive, or do I have to get tough? Tough? What, go in there and fight the Queen herself? No, I mean, get tough with you. You know, threaten. Offer violence. Intimidate you through use of magic powers, that sort of thing. There's no call for that sort of thing, sir. If you're going to take that attitude, I'm afraid I'm going to have to force you to go on a bizarre quest to find objects which will catch my interest and curry my favour. Oh, that would be a novelty. You've no one but yourself to blame, sir. Off you go. The days are wasting. Uh, what am I so supposed you, to get? Uh... You really like bees a lot, then? Oh, yeah, they're wonderful little things, sir. Such rich and varied lives. Zooming into the hive and, and zooming out again. And poetry. Pure poetry in motion. No one pays them enough attention, sir. That's what I think. If only someone would give the little darlings the recognition they deserve. Hmm, quite. I mean, it's all ants these days, sir. Ants this and ants that. And ants can carry hundred times their own body weight. And... Yes, now, look. I mean, it's nothing a bee can't cap, sir. Look at your basic regurgitation process or the fascinating little dances bees perform. Point. I see a flower filled with nectar. Point. Watch out for the spider's web over in that tree. Point. The clover's coming into bloom. Where's he <laughs> going? Oh, he was just getting into the really interesting bit. Ugh. Let's see. Ah, uh, here we go. Look, here's something that may interest you. You seem to know all about bees. Why don't you make a clicky about them? You could then pass on all your knowledge, so to speak. Mmm, you don't say. You know, you may just have something there. It's time the world knew the facts about bees. You know, you could have left behind all that good stuff there. So apparently, I've never done this, you know. I have not, never gone to putting... I've, Okay, so in a walkthrough I read it many years ago, you're supposed to put chili powder on the flowers. And I've never not done that. <sighs> yeah, some of that orange shasta coming back up. Yeah, oh boy. One of the towns is just like. Oh, there it goes, it's... And I would imagine if I didn't put the chili powder on there, I'd take the wax in the old granny, grandma store. 
And she'd say, oh, this isn't hot enough, so... I'd have to come back here and do it again, but I've... Okay... Uh... Let's see... Matches? Yeah, that'll really do the job. I got a big pot of honey. I guess I just reach in there with the hand and grab the wax out. Okay. Next up, go over here. Going through a lot of the, uh... Come to think of it, the Dean's more your stuffed flamingo sort of guy. Some very I, I should interrupt them. Perhaps when they're gone, we'll be back. Okay, you can't grab the hoops right this instant. The last person to grab a let's just leave the librarian. I keep double clicking on the luggage. Ah, Birdo. See what happens when goes after it's one the of the few stuff. organic life forms on campus that is almost definitely not an ex faculty member. Hmm. Thought I heard just someone say yes. If I only had Let's a just ladder, leave. Let's just leave. a stench and I can tell you my uh, office is pretty stinchy right now. Trying to think of what the heck it is. Was it the uh, Arby's roast beef and cheese? That was, I had a lot of that over the weekend. Alright, just going to... Oh! Uh, am I missing a bottle? Yeah, to put the, uh... Yeah. Why go through that conversation if I don't have to? But I'm missing something. I'm missing a bottle. Let's just leave him. I gotta... Cause I gotta put those boots in a bottle. I don't see it here. So it's somewhere. I'm just about ready to get the blood. I'm gonna go wake up the rooster. Okay, where do I find a quirkable bottle at? Maybe it's in the shop. That looks nice. Can I have it then? Certainly not. It's not for sale. Not that easy. So now I'm kind of wasting a lot of time looking around for a dang bottle. Where would that bottle be at? Uh, would it be in here in Gimli's? Mm, that door looks like it can open. Oh, man, I'm 
might have to go in and... Full could be bottled down here? I'm already in enough of a pickle. Okay, obviously not. You know, we're not going to see uh, Cass and Nunde for quite a while. I better ah, ask her there about... There it is. Quite well, thank you. We'll go. I got a migraine. Hello, Miss... That's better. Might I borrow that genie bottle you have up on the shelf up there? I tell you what, you can have the bottle, but only if you get me some nice fresh ectoplasm. Ugh. What? That's the... Uh. Not... Well, the... That said... Okay, I... There's like one more thing I needed to do at the university. Stop, luggage, stop! You don't tell what the luggage you don't. Of course, you don't tell what the luggage to do. No, no, no. Don't you know it's wrong to mix spirits? Oh, chucky, 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 chucky. Oh, chucky, 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 chucky. Oh, I've been slimed. Okay. Okay. Again, this into the shades. Go back to Mrs. Cakes. Huh. Yeah, take it and choke. She always keeping one eye closed, or did I forget to animate her le her left left eye? <laughs> Quickest way back to the center is to go this. Let's just leave. Okay, teeny bottle. Good idea. Here. It might hide the smell. Millennium hand and shrimp. Might have to title one of these videos that. Great. I've just captured a smell. I wonder if I'll ever be able to shake it off. Now I need to sober up the rooster. <laughs> that bird holds a lot of coffee. Okay. Now I'm going after the mouse blood. Close enough to, uh, Alucard over here. Oh, man. Inkill? In Kelligan. I forgot the names of everybody else from the vampire series. Oh. What are you doing to that bird, Wincy? Oh, he takes the glass with him. I gotta chase him down all the way to the graveyard. You know, this isn't the same cemetery that April and Bonnie work at. Um, I'm gonna need her later, much, much later. Oh, 
Marco and I gonna walk all the way across the room. Here's a nice little cutscene. <laughs> just, just a look on Winswin's face. Tube containing four cc's of mouse blood. Hmm, an undead mouse. A foul smell trapped in a genie bottle, guaranteed to not grant you any wishes. Phew. Quest completed. Three identical sticks. Now we're cooking. A petticoat. Such thin and delicate material, I can see clear through it. Ah, dribbly beeswax. Makes up in free spirit for what it lacks in stability. Yeah, and A the bees, for some reason, can't sting to through the brim it. With delicious honey. A wooden arm. Doesn't look very lifelike, does it? A pair of scissors. Actually, I'm not usually allowed to use the ones with pointy ends. An ironing board might have a dozen fascinating uses. And as soon as I figure one out, I'll get right back to you. Oh, no, not that old saw. Matches. Normally, I'm not allowed to play with these, but today we'll make an exception. A sharp cutting blade. Glitter dust, eh? Well, I'm sure this will come in very useful. Incense. Hmm. Frog scented. A clown's hooter. How I can blow my own horn at last. Hmm. A pick. Bellows. Strangely soothing to operate, but I don't know if they'll ever catch on. Now and walk all the way across the cemetery again. Over here. The dining hall's on the main road, main entrance. Man, that roll cake looks really good. All right, make sure I save this, save this game. I guess I saved it. Or do I need to... Y-O-U-D-U-B-E huh. There you go. Bet you thought a mouse didn't hold that much blood. Uh, how exactly... D no, no, never mind. <laughs> Some things are best left unknown. Let's just leave. Yeah, this up, upcoming might be a little bit Here you long. Are. One vile stench. What's this then? Looks more like a genie in a bottle. You'll get a lot more than you wish for if you open it. If I wanted one of those, if I wanted one. Of I still gotta make the candle. I'll go ahead and finish this then. up. Glitter dust for your perusal. Ah, right you are, my boy. Excellent. We'll make a junior apprentice wizard out of you yet. But I'm already an assistant wizard, third class. The day is still young. Look at this. Sticks, three they're off, all exactly alike. Precisely as specified. Oh, very good. What did you do then? Just go and get some sticks from the garden? Well, I never. Well, obviously you did. And even though I got the mouse blood in the sticks.
I goofed up. I gotta go back to the, uh, shop. Here's some nice sweaty and dribbly beeswax. Could you make me some candles, please? Certainly, my dear. Yeah, um, hey, um, we didn't write in the wick. Dribbly candles, just suitable for consorting with loathsome horrors from beyond the shrieking nightmares of mortal man. Here, what you planning, your highness? You're not trying to put one across on your husband or something, I hope. Look, I keep telling you I am not a princess, and I am not engaged in, in summoning evil entities from beyond. We've got plenty of demons running around the university in any case. Mostly they study law. Law? Why law? It's the wizard's fault, really. Everyone keeps saying that they want a demon to do their will. Hmm. Too much setup and not enough joke there, I feel. Excuse me, I think I have to leave. Oh yeah, I just want to get to Here we are. Genuine dribbly candles. And it wasn't only the bees that sweated getting these. Hmm. Not strictly necessary, but I suppose they'll look nice. Right. Well, that's it then. <sighs> that's three sticks of wood, four cc's of mouse blood, glitter, stench, and dribbly candles. Really? What for? For the right of Ash Kent. You, you, you said we needed it. I spent ages getting the right stuff. Ooh. I don't think so. For that one, you need to open the book, light the bell, and ring the candle. Or was it light the book, open the bell, and ring the candle? It, something like that. It's off you go. We need a candle, a book, and a bell. You're not serious, are you? Of course not. I just love watching the pathos crossing your helpless little face. <laughs> Come on, let's get these sticks and dribbly candles and do this Ashkent thing, shall we? Oh boy, this is bad. singing the booty song. the shout like that well the shout goes with the bongos not my bongos man you gotta go somewhere else oh good grief uh, uh, it didn't quite come out as planned did it who started us off on this mm -hmm. look i worked long and hard to get this stuff can we at least treat this ceremony with a little bit of... of... Damn it, I've lost my train of thought now. What's that word I was looking for? The, the one used for describing distinction. Um, differentiation of treatment. Repression? No, it's not going to be repression, is it? We can't treat a ceremony with a sense of repression. Uh, the dictatorship of the proletariat? What? The dictatorship of the proletariat. That results as an inevitable reaction against repression. Look, look, I think this would work better if everyone just got back on track. It's time we acted with a little bit of class. Class, that was it. The word was class. Uh, what word? Um, I don't know. 
But I'm sure it was important. What was? <laughs> How long have you uh, been here, then? Since the banana. Will this take long? I'm on holiday. It's good here. Sun, sheep, sand, hats with corks, no worries. I'm supposed to have a chander in a minute. A chander? What's a chander? You know, I'm not sure, but it sounds interesting. Now look here, you. This city is in chaos. I mean, how dare you go swanning off to foreign lands while we're up to our armpits in undead? Now you, you get right back here and get back to work. Work? I don't remember any work. All I remember is a great big bang. Then an eternity of beer. And no worries, mate. Lucky blighter. Now I've had about enough of this. You, you get off that finger me, get those corks out of your hat, and... What? Now, 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 just you come back here. I have a plan. Oh, no. Rincewind, lad! How wonderful to see you looking so, so well, so, so very sprightly, so very, shall we say, uh, so very mobile. You want me to go find out where death has gone? Oh, only if you don't want to spend the rest of your life staring out across a pond at all the other toads. Frogs? If you prefer. If we had a proper union like the alchemists do, I'd have a few harsh words for you. Uh, like? Uh, dictatorship of the uh... oh shut up act two come die with me all right that's it that's all I gotta do for this week uh the act two I'll be playing again in about another month or so oh I hope that saved. I don't want to have to play this all over again. I don't really have any other stories to tell. I Actually, I can tell stories, but that would be all kind of stupid. Well, 